Welcome to Daily Scripture Reading. I do not own the rights to this music. Genesis chapter 10, and this is the Amplified Version. These are the records of the generations, descendants of Shem, Ham, and Japheth, the sons of Noah, and the sons born to them after the flood, the sons of Japheth, Gomer, Magog, Madai, Javan, Tubal, Meshach, and Tyrez, the sons of Gomer, Ashkenaz, Ripoth, and Togarmah, the sons of Javan, Elisha, Tarshish, Kittim, and Dodanim. From these, the people of the coastlands of the nations were separated and spread into their lands, every one according to his own language, according to their constituent groups, families, and into their nations. The sons of Ham, Cush, Mizram, from whom descended the Egyptians, Put, and Canaan. The sons of Cush, Seba, Havilah, Sapta, Rama, and Saptika. And the sons of Rama, Sheba, and Dedan. Cush became the father of Nimrod. He became Nimrod. He became a mighty one on the earth. He was a mighty hunter before the Lord. Therefore, it is said, like Nimrod, a mighty hunter before the Lord. The beginning of his kingdom was Babel, and Erech, and Akkad, and Kana in the land of Shinar, and Babylonia. From that land, Nimrod went to Assyria, and built Nineveh, and Rehoboth, Ur, and Kala. And Nimrod built Rezin, which is between Nineveh and Kala. All these combined to form the great city Nineveh. Mizraim, the ancestor of the Egyptians, became the father of Ludim, Anamim, Leabim, Naphtuim, and Pathrezim, and Kasluhim, from whom came the Philistines and Kaphtarim. Canaan became the father of Sidon, his firstborn, and Heth, and the Jebusite, and the Amorite, and the Girgashite, and the Hivite, and the Archite, and the Sinite, and the Arbidite, and the Zimmerite, and the Hamathite. Afterward, the families of the Canaanite were spread abroad. The territory of the Canaanite extended from Sidon as one goes to Gerar, as far as Gaza, and as one goes to Sodom and Gomorrah, and Adma and Zeboim, as far as Lasha. These are the descendants of Ham, according to their constituent groups, according to their languages, by their lands and by their nations. Also to Shem, the father of all the children of Eber, including the Hebrews, the older brother of Japheth, children were born. The sons of Shem, Elam, Asur, Arkpaxet, Lud, and Aram. The sons of Aram, ancestor of the Syrians, Uz, Hol, Gether, and Mash. Arkpaxet became the father of Shelah, and Shelah became the father of Eber. Two sons were born to Eber. The name of one was Peleg, division, for the inhabitants of the earth were divided in his days, and his brother's name was Joktan. Joktan became the father of Almodad, Sheleph, Hazarmaveth, Jerah, and Hadaram, Uzal, Dikla, and Obal, Abiamel, Sheba, and Ufer, Havilah, and Jobab. All these were the sons of Joktan. Now their territory extended from Mesha, as one goes toward Shefer, to the hill country of the east. These are Shem's descendants, according to their constituent groups, families, according to their languages, by their lands, according to their nations. These are the families of the sons of Noah, according to their descendants, by their nations, and from these people. The nations were separated and spread abroad on the earth after the flood. The end. God bless you and thank you for joining me today.